Hi, my name is Jack Kramer. I'm here at Walzer Subaru in Burnsville. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 2022 WRX Limited. There's some great new stuff on the interior, but we're going to start on the exterior of the vehicle. All right, so taking a look at the uh, front end of the vehicle, we still have the iconic Subaru C-shaped headlights along with the updated front grille. So we're going to have a slightly larger uh, front grille for more air intake. And then if you look up at the top here, we have our Subaru EyeSight cameras. So those are going to give you a couple different extra driver features while you're on longer road trips or short commutes. Taking a look over at the side of the vehicle here, uh, we have our new lengthened track stance along with a wider, more aggressive look. The over fenders on the vehicle have a hexagon shaped pattern, which is supposed to reduce uh, turbulent air along with uh, giving more free range of uh, airflow over the face of the uh, wheel while you're driving. On the side of the vehicle, you'll also notice that they've uh, done a slight update just to the styling of the vehicle. They've made it a little bit more aggressive along with a wider rear end. So we're 0.2 inches wider in the rear, a uh, little bit more uh, grip on the rear end there. And then coming around to the rear of the vehicle, um, we have the new taillights here. Uh, they're supposed to be inspired uh, by flowing magma. Um, so they give a little bit more of uh, an aggressive look. So continuing with the rear end design, we have the uh, integrated lip here at the top, uh, along with the um, diffuser style uh, rear bumper. Your quad exhaust, along with your parking sensors, will be housed back here. Plenty of room in the uh, trunk space of the vehicle, 12.5 cubic feet, uh, which is more than the previous generation. All right, taking a look under the hood of the 22 WRX, we have the new 2.4 liter turbocharged engine with an electronic wastegate. That's 0.4 liters larger than last year, leading to an increase in power and torque. 271 horsepower along with 258 foot-pounds of torque. And now let's take a look inside the vehicle. Some of the optional equipment uh, that is standard on Limited, but not on all vehicles are gonna be things along the lines of your moonroof and the Harman Kardon speaker system. Uh, they really kind of bring the interior together, giving you a light feel with a bunch of bass coming from the uh, exceptional sound quality of the Harman Kardons. Uh, Bunding up the interior, there's a couple extra features in here as well. Uh, we have the illuminated door sills that are going to welcome you whenever you get into the vehicle. You're also going to have your home link and auto dimming rear view mirror, as well as side mirrors with a approach light along with your blind spot monitoring. All right, so taking a look at the rear of the vehicle here, we have uh, plenty of passenger space. I was just sitting in the front and I have plenty of room in the rear here as I'm six feet tall. You'll also notice there is two available charging ports along with four cup holders in the rear for all of your beverage needs. 